answer is yes. Hello and good day to you. Uh, I am Tan Chikian. You can call me CK or CK Tan. I am a consultant clinical oncologist at Thompson Hospital, Kota Damansara in Malaysia. I treat most adult solid tumours with special interest in breast, lung, head and neck, central nervous system as well as gastrointestinal tract malignancies. I'm also passionate about clinical research and am actively involved as a primary investigator in multiple industry-sponsored research. Even though advanced cancer is not curable, but it's actually very much treatable. In fact, some patients with advanced cancer can have durable disease control with good quality of life for many years with effective treatment. And now, let me show you Thompson Hospital Kota Damansara's brand new center. Based on the Global Can 2020 data, there were 19.3 million new cancer cases worldwide, with 10 million cancer deaths in 2020 itself. The global cancer burden is expected to continue rising with an estimated 28.4 million new cancer cases by 2040. The top three cancers globally are breast, lung, and colorectal cancer. In Malaysia, we share the same top three cancers where Breast cancer is the commonest, followed by colorectal and lung cancer. There is an estimated 23,000 new cancer cases per year in Malaysia, with 1 in 10 males and 1 in 9 females having a lifetime risk of developing cancer. Over the last few years, advancement in cancer management has grown by leaps and bounds. Gone were the days when one treatment fits all cancer using only cytotoxic chemotherapy. We are now in the era of precision medicine where patient's management is very much individualized based on the tumor subtype and its molecular characteristics. Despite the advancement in the cancer management and treatment, the outcome or the prognosis of the patients ultimately is very much dependent on the stage of presentation. The later the stage the patient presents themselves to the hospital, the worse outcome it will be, despite all the advancement that has been done to the treatment as well as the management. Based on the old saying, prevention is better than cure. Therefore, screening is actually of utmost importance for patients. This is because screening will be able to detect the cancer at its earlier stage and hence render the patient a better outcome and prognosis during the cancer journey.
here at Thompson Hospital, Tata Damansara, we adopt a holistic approach when treating patients, taking into account the disease factors, patient's factors, as well as the needs for individual patients. Systemic therapy such as chemotherapy, targeted therapy, hormonal therapy, and immunotherapy are readily available at Thompson Hospital, Kota Damansara. We also have the state-of-the-art radiation machine capable of doing multiple radiation techniques such as 3D conformal, IMRT, radio surgery, as well as stereotactic body radiation. Always discuss with your doctors about your concerns and for us to understand your unique medical condition and to make informed decision on your treatment. Before taking any medicines or supplements, always talk to your doctor first as this may cause drug interactions as well as potentially affect the outcome of your treatment. One of the commonest questions I always get asked is whether cancer cells like sugar or if the patient stop taking any sugar product, it will be helpful to control the cancer. The answer to that is actually no. All cells in our body require glucose, which is a form of sugar, as an energy to function. Hence, restricting sugar intake may affect our body function but have no effect on the cancer control. Can cancer spread or infect others? No, unlike COVID-19, you won't infect your family or friends with cancer by sharing the same room, eating together, or staying in the same house. Cancer care is very much a team effort. Together, our team of supporting staff and consultant will be there with you throughout the cancer journey to achieve the best possible outcome. As mentioned, cancer care requires a multidisciplinary team approach. At Thompson Hospital Kota Damansara, we provide services for all major disciplines such as radiology and interventional radiology, nuclear medicine, breast, upper and lower gastrointestinal surgeons, orthopedics, cardiothoracic surgeons, chest physicians, fertility specialists, and others to care for you during your cancer journey. Mm -hmm.